Hello everyone, welcome back. We're playing Tainted Lost again, and it looks like we're starting off on an extra large floor. Okay, and here's our first item room, as well as some money. What do we have? Eden's Blessing? Okay, that's actually pretty good. We got some tears, we're gonna get an item on the next run. Pretty solid starting item. Thank you for the key. Now I can open this up. Ooh, look at the money I got from that, and a bomb for this. And some more damage, look at that. Look at our stats already. Pretty solid. Now we have money for our shop, and everything's just looking good. Okay. Anyway, mom's box? Okay. Ah, uh, definitely not torn card. We'll leave that behind. But mom's box is my favorite active item. It not only spawns trinkets, but also it doubles their effect. So if I get cancer, that's even more tears. If I get curved horn, then that's going to be even more damage. Lucky sack, that's two sacks. I mean, it's just... It's just a great item. Okay, well, we're getting a lot of chests thanks to my extra luck from the box again. And we're getting 120 volt as our second item on this floor. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's go fight our boss. Our first boss, I mean. Uh, if I don't end up getting a good trinket, which is very unlikely, but if I don't, then since I'm going to be getting perfection, it'll be 20 luck instead of 10. Which, I don't know what a difference that's going to make, but it's definitely a lot of luck. So it would be... 23 luck, I guess, because I have a pretty decent amount of luck already. Well, 120 volt is putting in some damage. I got hurt because of it, though. That's entirely my fault. Uh, ooh. Hey, Incubus on the first floor. That's amazing. So we're going to stick with that. And we're already going on to our third floor. There we go. Or I think our secret room is probably right here. We have another charge of this strange key. Okay, interesting. If I get Pandora's box, that'll be six items. Ooh, Soul of Lilith. Dark Soul Bum. You know, Lilith. whatever. I can't pick up Red Hearts anyway. Okay, what do you have? E you have rocking in a jar. Alright, here's our shop. We got plenty of money. And we have Pan... Pandora's... Okay. I just got Strange Key. You've got to be kidding me. Uh, well, let's just... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. That was huge. And I wouldn't have had that happen if I didn't get Mom's box. I would have ignored Pandora's box. I can't believe that. That's the second time that's happened to me. Alright, let's kill this boss. Alright, this boss is going to actually not drop just a shitty item. We can actually get something good. Okay, I happened to perfectly grab the bad item all right well we have some good things in here mom's knife we're gonna ignore that um i think what i want to grab is death's touch there we go our run got a whole lot more interesting after that all right let's check this out right i'm tainted lost nothing good in here trinket rib of greed hey that's gonna be useful that's going to keep away greed and super greed and our shops are really valuable so that's great Okay, stapler. I mean, yeah, they're really valuable. I got Glitch Crown out of them. All it cost was 30 cents, basically. Ooh, no thanks. But yeah, we're leaving behind Rib of Greed because we just got Little Clot. Oh, don't hurt me. Question is, though, am I going to want to keep the Little Clot or am I going to want to get grab Perfection when I get it? Because that 23 luck with Holy Light would be kind of crazy, but also this amount of tears is really good as well. I don't know, but... For now, we'll keep the tears, because it's just going to destroy everything. I almost just died. Okay, let's take tears or damage. Let's take the damage. I... Th let's let's see. Let's see how it looks. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. The clots are good, but not that good, right? Four times damage, I think it is, that the lights do. That's too good to pass up. Plus piercing. I mean, come on. All right. Let's check this four more options there is more options and we perfectly grabbed it now we're gonna be pulling from 10 items c-section oh my god i see this like every other run i swear that's i mean that's tainted lost right that's my tainted lost experience at least well yeah okay that was pretty good we've majorly improved our secret rooms we got one of the best secret room items and now we're on death's one something i'm realizing is that c-section plus the babies is C-section plus the babies, what am I talking about? C-section plus the light beams, I think is going to make the light beams proc multiple times per enemy. Well, 
except when they die instantly, but like for bosses and stuff, that's gonna be really good. That Pandora's box and the stuff that came out of it is massively carrying my run. It would not be nearly as good without it. All right, what do we have in here? Oh my God. That is Cricket's head right there. Let's grab that. We perfectly timed it. Cool, let's grab this, use that. Ah, uh, wooden cross. It's too good as this character to pass that up. Oh my goodness. That's gonna be two Holy Mantles per floor instead of zero. So I'll definitely take that over the perfection. All right, here we are at the boss. I haven't found my shop yet, but it's only depths one, so it's all good. Uh, don't kill me, please. Oh wait, I have a Holy Mantle. I don't need to be afraid. All right, let's take the damage since we got a damage multiplier. There we go. Let's also go and find our shop, which look at that, we found it immediately. Oh, didn't notice those. And it has, ooh, um, those are all really good. Member card is great with a lot of money. Car battery is great with our active item, but I think what I want to do is grab mystery gift. And then we're going to want to put it in our secret room, which is here. Okay, look at that. We have five items to choose from. One, here, wait, let's go grab mom's box and trade it out for the eternal D6. All right, and as long as we time this right, there we go. Thanks, Mom's Box. You've been really good, but we're re-rolling you. That's a guaranteed re-roll. The D-Infinity. All right. And then we're going to use this to re-roll this again. We are slamming through the secret room pool. Let's get one more re-roll, and we're probably going to get something good. Oh, we got a teleport. I guess the Pact. That's pretty good. More tears. Oh, but we didn't get the charge from this. Um, I hope we get more charge. We can get charge in here, maybe... Well, we have a gup three guppy items to choose from. Let's grab the tail for more chests on the chest. I just need two more charges. Just a little... Is there one in the shop, maybe? Let's see. No, there wasn't. 48-hour energy. That's not 48-hour energy. Is there anything else I can do? Maybe a top secret room? That, okay, there we go. No. If we just didn't get that teleport, this would be all good. I mean... <laughs> I mean, we could grab TM Trainer, that would be... Yeah, let's do it, for the chaos, why not? Maybe a mistake, whatever. I think our build is plenty strong enough that any mistakes aren't really a problem. All right, what's in here? Double bomb this. And we have, it's a clean bedroom, which means we're gonna get a crawl space. And there is probably gonna be an item in here. I hope there's an item in here. I wanna start getting these glitched items. All right, go. See, stock. Okay. I really hope we don't get one that just instantly kills us. This actually could be good since I don't have anything to reroll anymore. Let's keep the chariot and let's. Oh, it rerolls it into a glitched item. Okay, well, hey, it's gonna do something at least. It looks like every room we're throwing out of Bob's brain. Not Bob's brain, what is it called? Oh no, we just got the mark. Okay, it doesn't matter. Another passive item. Yeah, no, we have we have the mark. Or er, marked, that's what it's called. Okay, this one I wanna drop the I wanna drop the thing so that I can keep it. Never mind. Alright, here's our shop. Ooh, 29 cent item, what a steal. Actually there's a 22 cent item here. I don't know what that's gonna do. I mean at this point I'm just grabbing as many items as I can, I'm gonna be honest. Okay, here we are at a boss. That is a 20. Oh, it's mom. Okay, it's fine actually. We already we already saw our item room and our shop. But our build right now is plenty strong that we don't need to worry about getting any more items because you're not always guaranteed some more power. Thankfully, the Polaroid and the negative are always the same. Okay. Uh, let's grab this one. It's an active item. I think I want to drop this thing now. I think I want to keep my active items that I get. Not if they remove my speed. We'll see what this one does. Reverse stars. Reverse stars would be a bad idea. Since that's my Eden's blessing, I'm not trying to get rid of that. Okay, here we are on the womb. It's been interesting. Oh, uh, how did I not die there? I don't know how I didn't die there, but there's a holy card. Thank goodness. Because we no longer have our wooden cross. I don't know what happened to it. I couldn't tell you. So far, nothing crazy from TM Trainer, though. I mean, there's some interesting things, but nothing crazy. Maybe there's an item in here. There is. There's two items in here. Look at that. Passive. Oh. 
No, don't kill me. Maybe I should have waited to pick up the items. Okay. Oh my god. We might have we might have found something broken. It's it's possible. We just spawned another boss. Is that supposed to happen? I I'm actually not even sure. Yes, every time I pick up Look at that. Every time I pick up a pickup, it spawns a boss. Oh, it does D7. That's probably what it does. No, are we just not going to get any more pickups? I'm trying to test. I'm trying to test the item here. All right, there's there's a pickup. Yeah, it does D7. Okay. Thankfully, we have plenty of pickups, so if we get in a dangerous room, we don't need to grab the pickups. Um, ooh, item. Oh, everything we grab activate the D7. Er, yeah. Okay. Well, that was... We're kind of insanely powerful. More powerful than I would have ever expected. Um, thanks for the holy card. I'm surprised it didn't respawn the boss. Um, this one. I will have no idea if that was the best one to grab, but hey, here we are on the mom's heart floor. You know, this is fun. Maybe I should, maybe I should do some TM Trainer exclusive runs. Just ones where I start with TM Trainer. Ooh, that speed is kind of rough. Ooh, that gave me stats. Like speed. How convenient. Am I going to keep those stats? I am. Okay, wait, wait a sec. What is this active item? Does it just give stats or... Now at that time it did nothing. Oh my god, is this hush pace? Is this hush pace? It is. Wait, we're gonna fight hush with this? I wanna see what kind of crazy things we get because we've seen some pow- Whoa, that was an accident. But yeah, we've seen some powerful things so far, but, but not really any powerful enemy to like warrant the power. So we'll kind of see that with the hush. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, this gets a little annoying. Is my game crashing? Oh my god, it froze for so long. I was so worried it was gonna crash. All right. It lives. Let's see if we do anything crazy here. I don't think so. We've slowed down the fight. Nope. Nothing crazy. But let's go test this out on Hush. Okay, let's see how many extra items we're gonna get. Done from those. A three cent item. I can definitely afford that. It's an active item. A four cent item. I can definitely afford that. Hey. Oh, is this going to turn everything into pickups? Okay, it didn't. Which active item do we want to use for Hush? Which one is going to be the one? Um, that one gave some speed. Well, it looks like we're going to be using this one. Maybe I should have kept the speed one. Let's do it. Let's see. It spawned a sack of pennies. Isn't that just great? Well, we're definitely plenty powerful with the light beams and the babies, but that's nothing new. That has nothing to do with TM Trainer. I mean, hey, the ba the light beams and the babies are definitely putting in a lot of damage. Nothing crazy is happening, though. Unfortunately, I was kind of hoping we get some crazy things. Right now, I'm just playing Hold Left Simulator. Still have yet to have to move. Just the left arrow key. If I had a keystrokes recorder right now, it would just be showing left arrow key. Okay, let's move now. <laughs> uh, the dodges are crazy. Oh, okay. These are dangerous. All right. Almost there. There we go. And we did it. Barely. Okay, let's go. Here we are on the cathedral. Let's get this out of the way. Let's also try and avoid dying. I don't have a... There's a lot of bombs around and I don't have a holy card. All right, here we are at our boss. Isaac, face me. Oh my god, we should have used our... We should have used our sun card. It's so loud, jeez. Well, we can use our sun card here. We can see the whole floor. Isn't that just so good? Okay. We have four items. Let's hope they're all pickups. I got some damage. That's surprising. Quite the noise there. Let's try and maybe see what these items are doing for us. So far, we're spawning items. Oh, and deleting items also. That's something. Oh, I have Brit. I'm a Zazzle? Why am I a Zazzle? Oh no, this is where it starts to get crazy. I'm a Zazzle, but I still don't have health. Um, what am I, what is even, what is even happening? I need to stop grabbing things. Uh, okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> what is this? Oh, I, 
I, I don't even know what's going on. Uh, I'm like three characters in one right now. I, am I immune to damage? I don't want to test this theory. I'm... I'm... A, what's my health? Am I immune to damage? What is... Okay, we're just gonna keep grabbing... Yep, I think I'm immortal. I think I'm immune to damage here. Oh, and now we got death certificate. We're actually gonna get actual items here? This is the a calm in the chaos because it's so quiet here. There's no enemies. Just some nice items. If I have two Eden's Blessings, is that gonna give me two items on the next run? I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. I think I have a powerful and interesting enough run that I can just go ahead and grab that. Uh, okay, I'm back to lost, so I, I'm not gonna bet on the fact that I'm immortal. Let's hope it's still the case, though. No, I wanted those items. I'm immortal! I'm actually invincible! Jump scare. I'm gonna have to turn that down. I'm just gonna keep grabbing items. I'm just gonna keep grabbing items. Keep grabbing items. Okay. Teleport right to the boss. Oh. Okay. Top secret room. That's cool too. Look, I don't even. I have no words for this. I'm also. I also still don't know how I'm invincible. Okay. Two more rooms. Then we got our boss. Ouch. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Now we actually have health. And now we have no items to fight the boss. Actually, yes, we do. We have all the items. Thankfully. Uh. Okay. Well, it looks like we did it. After switching characters like a million times and having infinite health, and now we have two soul hearts and zero items. Um, if you want to see me do a TM trainer start run, then, you know, I'll probably do that. That sounds really fun. Let me know. And I hope you all enjoyed. Have a wonderful rest of your day.